YouTube, Poor Man's Guide to You here. We are with Tristan today. What's up? And he topped locals with uh, blue eyes. So, can I get into the deck list here? Yep. All right, so I'm going to start with the monsters. Uh, pretty standard. Three blue eyes. Ghost I like it. Three sage. Very cool. This is your main engine of the deck. <laughs> this allows you to go into your extra deck so easily along with the field spell. Cool. Three ancient stone. Cool. This also allows you to use your blue eyes from the deck when it's in the graveyard. So it's pretty much a recycle. Gotcha. And then the other one that you play three of is Maiden. Of course. Why would not? Yeah. Standard stuff. <laughs> All right. And then two white spirits. Uh, mainly, I play two for uh, just banishing on their opponent's turn to because of pendulum scales and stuff like that cosmos uh, monarchs that's uh, my main out to them you ever thought about uh, three I have uh, three tends to be a, just a little too bricky gotcha. um, so two is optimal cool two Valor um, normally when you play Valor you side it but since you're able to search it out with sage yeah you main deck it and then uh, I'm teching these two cards in Galaxy Soldier. Dang, cool. Um, it's a for an infinity play since they're all lights. I can pretty much discard them, and then with Ancient Stone, I can banish to add back if I need be. Gotcha. And then if I happen to send Ancient Stone, I get to use Ancient Stone. Very cool. Uh, one fader. Yes. Uh, if I draw really bad, or my Ancient Stone gets killed, or I'm protecting myself from game. Gotcha. Global. Um, huh. This card is. One of the best tuners to throw in this deck. Yeah. Um, a play uh, later on I'll show is y you just need to use this one card instead of two tuners. Okay. One white stone um, just to have another tuner and also it's uh, another target for Carter Cool. Yeah. And then one master uh, utility in the graveyard basically. Alrighty. How many monsters? Um. I believe that is 19 or 20 monsters. Cool. And then onto spells. Three trade ins. Drop out. If you don't play three, it's kind of just, you know, yeah. why? Uh, two twin twisters. Uh, Standard. Yeah. Yeah, you can play three. Um, just not right now. Uh, most of the blue eye stuff hasn't come out yet. So two is optimal. When uh, more blue eye stuff comes out, you can play three. But side the third one, I say. Uh, two Silver Scry, again, um, when more Blue Eye stuff comes out, um, you know, you can't play three, two is optimal right now. One Regeki, uh, you need Destruction right now, uh, until Alternate comes to the TCG format, uh, that, that's your main out to anything. And then, one Mausoleum, All right. uh, this field spell is broken. Uh, it allows you to go into Crystal Wing on turn one wow. if you have Sage in hand. Crazy. Yeah. Uh, show the play later on. One card of Consonants. Draw power. Yep. Uh, yeah, four targets for it. So if you play two, that's fine. It, it, it tends to be just a little bricky, but one is better because uh, you want the Ancient in the graveyard. One, one Terraforming, so you can also drop Crystal Wing first turn. Uh, it also thins out your deck you're playing with a 39 card deck instead of 40. Gotcha. And then one Lance. Ooh, uh, interesting. The tech card for Maiden uh, on my opponent's turn or my turn if I want to go into Spirit. Oh yeah. And I believe that's um, uh, 13 spells. All right. 13. Pretty balanced. And then uh, for Traps, I have one Call. Call. I like it. Another, another special, you know. Yep. Allows me to go into uh, White Spirit. Blue eyes need be. Cool. One vanities. Rex meta. Yes. <laughs> One uh, drowning. Jeez. <laughs> also, again, saves lives. Yes. Yes, it does. Um, one strike. Uh, for another monster negation. Uh, and also against pendulum and monarchs and cosmos. Pretty much <laughs> everything. <Yeah. laughs> and one warning. All right. Standard. Yeah. And then. One scolding. All right. So, would you rather play um, two strike than a scolding and a strike? Uh, personally, I prefer a scolding, just because 
there will be times where you need to negate a spell or a trap, you know. I mean, monster effects are good, but there are also times where you need to negate a trap or a spell to win. So, right. you know. If you get anything to the main deck, uh, what would you add? One for one. One for one, alright. Uh, mainly you search out uh, Glow Up Bowl, and also it's, it's another discard outlet uh, for... Like the high levels, if you want to call the haunted them, or uh, use ancient stone to add them back with trade in, you know, if if need be. Uh, it, definitely one for one would be a, one of the main cards I would add. Uh, currently, anything else right now, um, I'm open for ideas. So cool. I'm, I'm a bit play testing. With this. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So on to the extra deck. Uh, two spirit. Of course. I wouldn't recommend playing three, and three is kind of just like, you, you lose deck space, yeah, yeah, extra deck space, so two is optimal. And then two is your eyes, again, uh, it's optimal. If you play three, it's kind of just like, eh, so yeah. All right. All right. And then on to uh, some text. One Moonlight. Um, Personally, I would want this to be an Ancient Fairy, mm -hmm. just because I can destroy a field spell. It doesn't have to be mine, so if I'm going against Cosmos or Monarchs, I can destroy their field spell if they gotcha. don't have one, mm -hmm. and then I can add my Mausoleum. Oh, I see, yeah. So, and, the, and uh, I gain a thousand, so yeah. it's like, it's sweet. And then that allows me to go into Crystal. Gotcha. Yeah, that card is very annoying. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. So... Yeah, this card right here, when I figured out Blue Eyes can go into it, I instantly picked it back up. Yeah. Um, this card is just Rex Meadows right now. So, ever thought about playing more than one? Playing more than one is, is it, it hurts the extra deck space because you kind of do need your XC monsters, which I'm going to get into. Gotcha. Um, if you do play two, you would have to cut down on the XCs. Mm -hmm. One Twin Burst. This is. Uh, uh, last resort play if I need to save myself, and I know that they don't have any destruction cards like Regeki or Dark Hole. So that gotcha. allows me to banish stuff that can't be targeted. Cool. Yeah. Alright, so on to the X Seeds. Uh, for first, we have one Tachyon. Ooh, Ghost Rare. I like it. Mm -hmm. And then I really don't even use its effect, I just use it for overlay material for full armor. Of course. And then I use full armor to detach one. Mm -hmm to destroy, which is really good. And then into Dark Matter. Oh man, card's too good. Yep, so the turn one play would be to, um, if you have the field spell, you go Maiden, use main, uh, use uh, Mausoleum, target Maiden, main effect, special summon Blue Eyes, send the Blue Eyes, and then if you have a Silver Scry in hand or a Swing of Memories, you special summon the one that you sent from the graveyard, and then you go into Tachyon, and then into Full Armor, and then into Dark Matter. And then you send Ancient, a Blue Eyes, and then White Spirit, and then during the end phase, you special summon the White Spirit. Wow, crazy. Yeah. Um, the, 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 the play is a lot better when you have alternate, you know, because yeah. there's more targets. One Harbringer, I normally don't bring this out unless I'm going up against Monarchs. I use it to negate Stormforth. Oh yeah, Cause it's annoying. Everything in here is pretty much good against everything else except for Stormforth, and I have nothing that can really negate Stormforth unless I'm, I have the Skull Yeah. Gotcha. And then one Felgrand. Um, I don't. Yeah, I use it for the negation. I don't even use it for the unaffecting. Mm -hmm. um, it just allows me to have another some some sort of breakthrough. I consider it a breakthrough. Cool. Uh, one uh, Heliopolis. Yep. This card is really good um, when I need to clear fields and I have a lot of monsters in hand. Uh, I just pretty much send anything I don't want in my hand into the graveyard and destroy everything and it doesn't target. So, And on top of that, it's a dragon. So if I have Azure Eyes on the field while this is on the field, it can't be destroyed. Cool. And then uh, since I'm playing the Galaxy Soldier, yep. one Nova, one Infinity cool. for another negation. All right. So thank you for that. Very cool deck profile. You You're 4 0 today. Yes. What was the hardest deck you played against? Uh, my last match, it was Pendulums. I, I bricked really hard game two. Um, game three, it was a, kind of a stall match. Um, he went into Rafazia, I went into Jurais, and 
kind of just just stopped there. Um, I had a scolding set, and then after that, I kind of just waited until I could get my uh, vanities on field, and then yeah, kind of just attack for me. All right, thank you very much. No